Hey there guys, welcome back to week two of Beat the Hobbit, where I attempt to beat Frodo from the Shire to Mount Doom as quick as possible and raise money for when you wish upon a star. Now if you guys want to get involved in this, please go to the Just Giving website, that's justgiving.com, and search Beat the Hobbit. You can help me out raise money for this amazing charity. Now, I'm not going to mess about, we'll get straight into the details. Of course, we start off with Frodo and his results right here. Now, we're sticking to the average 9.7 that he always has on that, and that won't change because we couldn't figure out how far he is or where he is in the map at any given time. So, 9.7 across the board, that gives him a total of 67.9 miles that he's managed this week. That means what he has left is 1,688.9 miles. Now, good result on his half. Time to look at mine. Here comes my results right here. Now, I'm not going to go over flood days before I did that last time and list them all off, but you can see they're there. You can have a look at them all there. But my total would be 108 miles, 108.22 miles. That's what I managed this week, which leaves me with 1,607.34 miles to go. So much further along than the old Frodo. Means the distance between us now is 81.56 miles, roughly put me about eight days ahead of him. So I'm, I'm kicking his butt at the minute and hoping if I keep this pace up, I should actually beat him by a solid month. So I'm going to keep that up. But he currently would be in the challenge, still in the Shire area. I have now passed the Shire area, and I've got my first medal here. So I get to have a good look at this one. Look, just popped it off. Check this bad boy out there. That's the first medal that you get from it. It's the envelope that uh, Frodo gets from his uncle. And what I, I've noticed on this one, I saw in some of the videos, it's really cool. So that's that's the back of the medal. We can get a good look at that just there. And the front, like that. That is sweet. And like I say, you can hear, that's solid metal. There's nothing to mess about. There's a bit of a chip on the back. Oh, no, that's some glue. That's okay. But you check this out. You lift the envelope up, the ring is inside. And you actually take the ring out, the one ring to rule on that's got some lovely detail in it. If I get it close enough so the camera can focus on it, ah, it's not going to focus on it properly, but that is pretty sweet. Now, once you actually get to the end, you can drop that into the last medal, the actual volcano. So we'll be holding on to my precious right to the very end. Oh, I'm being visited. Would you like to wear my medal? Yes. There we go. Because I'm the pretty one. She's the pretty one. Do you want the ring to rule them all? The one ring. Is this the way? To rule them all, yes. Is it meant to be? So that's the first part of that done. The Shire is now completed. I'm going into the fellowship. Oh, oh showing the camera there. Oh, oh, she's got the one ring. Awesome sauce. Where do you put it? There it goes inside, right here. Oh, inside here. We'll pop it back in. Keep that safe and it'll stay there until we get to the end of the challenge. So, once again, guys, don't forget, justgiving.com, search Beat the Hobbit, help out this amazing charity to grant wishes for these kids who have such challenging lives. You can be a part of it and help us out, and hopefully we'll get to the end. See you in Mount Dew. Bye.